I was talking to Reverend Sally today. We were on our prayer walk going to mail Lori her, uh, her spiritual warfare book. And she was asking me about prayer. And I said, you know what prayer is? Most often used and least effective tool that we have at our disposal. Oh, they're going to lose their mind, Reverend Sally. They're going to lose their mind. But I'm going to give it to them again. Prayer is the most often used and the most ineffective tool you have at your disposal. Do you know what people do all the time? When they're praying, they're really begging. God, give me a job. God, give me a house. God, give me this. The Bible says don't worry about what you should wear or what you should eat or what you should do. So right away, you're asking for stuff that God said not to even worry about. So you're, it, it, it's the most ineffective use of a tool with the least results. Because, you say, you know, if it be your will, Father, uh, well, if you know what his will is or what his will ain't because it's in the Bible. It's right here in the Word of God. You know what his will is. If you don't hear from the Holy Spirit, it says right here in the, in the, in the, um, in the Bible, in the inspired Word of God, it says what his will is. So if you're praying for healing... And you're asking me to pray for healing. Could you pray that for if, if, if for healing in my dog? No. No, I won't pray for healing. No, nope, I'm not going to pray for a financial restaurant. I'm, nope. I'm going to pray that God uses whatever that is that's in your life to his glory. I'm going to pray. I'm going to ask God to be revealed and to be exalted and to, and to be praised in every situation. Because that's, that's where... People don't die is in the praise. That's where people are, are restored is in the praise. See, people think by praying, 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 that's going to move God. If that moved God, guess what? Everybody would be having what they want. It says God indwells the praise of his people. When you praise God, then the sickness, then the fear, then the doubt, then the anxiety, then the confusion, then the and then forgiveness and repentance. Then those saints fall off. You praise God and those saints that you were praying about won't even be there for you to pray about no more. Did I